y'all, Kalisha here. How y'all doing? I thought that we would do something different today. I have two Thread Up Rescue Boxes that I'm going to unbox, but I also have two Poshmark Mystery Reseller Boxes, and I thought we would do like a little comparison. I did think, though, that I uh, purchased two different uh, Poshmark Mystery Boxes from two different sellers, but I think well, no, I don't, I don't think. I know now that I purchased it from the same uh, seller. Um, I will blame it on mom brain. So, yeah, I suffer from mom brain, and I did do that. But, anywho, let's move on. If I stop and stare like a deer caught in headlights, I just dyed my hair, and I'm not used to the color yet. And, sorry, it's not fixed. If you, those who know me personally know that I am not a, I don't have patience for hair. I don't like doing hair. I don't like doing my own hair. So, I don't know. I must have, something went wrong with that girl gene in me. I just, it's not my thing. I hate to fool with it. Uh, it has a mind of its own. And it's wanting to do some kind of Joe Dirt thing today. I'm going to let it go. And we're going to go on with the video. Okay. So I will start up with the Thread Up Fun Box. I think this is the Fun Box. We'll find out when I open it. I think it's the Fun Box. Um, $18 is what it cost. And I didn't pay shipping because they were doing the two days free shipping. And who doesn't want to have fun? It's a Fun Box. Let's get with it. Okay. It came with Permission to splurge. Hello, 2019. 15% off your order in January. Use code splurge15. Can you see that, guys? Yeah. Um, how to refresh your haul. So, I guess it's just some tips on how to take care of um, your um, used clothing, I guess, that you get from them. And, of course, the invoice. And it's they are back to, it looks like... They're back to that now. I'm not gonna put this in my lap. I'm gonna take it out of my lap. Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, looks like we got a pair of sunglasses, which usually, you know, they come with a pair of sunglasses. Oh, these have something on them. And these are an um, interesting <laughs> shape. So, Someone purchased these. These were someone's thing, so I'm not saying nothing. This, I don't think, would be my thing on my head, on my peanut head. It doesn't look to be any brand. Hand polished china. Uh, P1964 polycarbonate. UV400 CE. Um, I'm going to put these on, and I know it's going to be very interesting looking. Oh, yeah. Um, I put these on, and they sort of look like the beginning of a costume to either The Incredibles or some X-Men comic book. But, yeah. Um, and something's weird about them. They're, like, flat. Am I? Yeah. They're, like, flat, and they're, they're a little... Mm. But, hey. It's a fun box, and these were fun shape. I don't know. Okay, let's move on, please. Okay, what is this? Let me open this. Well, I don't want to mess up the paper. I do want to reuse the paper. They usually come with a phone case. This was the phone case it came with. Okay. Um... Nothing special. I've only had this real wine right, right about now. Okay, let's move on. There is something in it, but it feels like there is nothing in it. Bluey? Louie's over there on the love seat lane. He is not behind me like he usually is. Hey, I'm missing my wingman, Louie. You gotta come help me out. You're my Vanna. Okay. 
Okay, now I know why it felt so light. Is there anything else in it? A joke card or nothing? Okay, nothing. Um, yeah. This is says Fashion Accessory. Don't know where it came from. It's not a brand. It's a very light. It actually looks like that your kid went to Chuck E. Cheese and played a bunch of games and got a bunch of tickets and thought, I would get Mommy a necklace what it looks like okay this is a fun box right but is it supposed to be fun for the employees like is there someone there at the warehouse putting this together going I'll put this in a jewelry box and they will think they got something yeah uh, so far the fun's not on this end might have been on that end but it's not on this end okay something else. Maybe it's better. It's in a jewelry box. We'll, we'll see. What is that? Seriously. They put a headband in it. Is it underneath it? No. Nope. Just a hair headband kind of thing. It's got that cotton from it. Looks like it's got like a little leather like woven in it but yeah that is what was in it again not fun on this end might have been fun at the warehouse let's see start up do you need to pay your employees more are they disgruntled putting this box together I, i'm feeling a little hostility from it's got bad energy okay this box fell out of it, so I'll just go on. This is make up. What is that? Oh, these are knee highs. Knee highs. Nice. Do I wear knee highs? No, but somebody wears knee highs. I've never heard of this brand though, but. Is this like another vintage? I got vintage pantyhose before from them. Who buys stuff and holds on to it for 20 years and then gets rid of it? Who does that? I bought myself knee highs. I will give them away when I'm 80. Okay. Oh, okay. Now I see. We got an infinity scarf. Not bad. Not bad at all. Can wear it with my little sunglasses. I got this from Posh. My daughter thought it it's not her. She doesn't like it. She said it looks like something an older woman, which I am an older woman. I'm going to embrace it. Um, would wear. So this is purple blue, which I was picking up those colors. Yeah. So it's an infinity scarf studio 74. Don't know anything about that, but okay. Hmm. Yeah. Here's some hostility. Pay your employees. It'll be nicer putting these boxes together. This box here, jewelry, and it is heavy. Heavy. I'm just, I can't imagine what this could be. Oh, it is a huge, heavy watch. Oh my, I wish you all could like feel how heavy this is. It is definitely all stainless steel. It is a Nixon, it says. Don't know much about Nixon. The watch. I'm not, I didn't, wasn't raised under a rock. <laughs> I didn't know Nixon that was president. But, yeah. This is really, I mean, heavy. This is what you, like, put in your purse. When, like, a purse snatcher comes up and tries to grab your purse, you just take it and you can literally beat them to death with this in your purse. This is, like, something you take when you're, like, at a bar and you get into it with someone. You'd be like, hold my shoes, hold my earrings, let me get my watch out because you're going to do some damage with this thing. I have never felt something so heavy before. This is, like... I mean, it's pretty, though. The white is gorgeous. I just can't imagine 
all day long. You know that commercial where everything was like offset and this person in the town like had this huge arm and one little arm? They had this watch. They had this watch. I couldn't imagine how strong you would get wearing this watch, or at least one arm wearing this watch. You probably have bruises on your wrist. I have never felt anything so heavy as a watch. That was a watch. Okay. Not familiar with this brand. If any of you all are, um, let me know. It is a pretty watch. Not as pretty as the head <laughs> headband, but anyhow. Okay, let's see what else we got. Because we have another box. I'm almost scared to open it. It's not as heavy as the first one. Okay. It is a bracelet silver bracelet doesn't have it's got one little marking and it is the the 925 marking but as far as brand wise I might try this on if I can as far as brand size I mean brand it doesn't have anything it definitely the shape and everything, it, it's something that looks better on, I think, than it did just looking at it. I mean. Now, get off me. I'm trying to get it off. Can you not get off me? There we go. Got it. So, yeah, I mean, it, it's got a little funky shape, something different. There is more in this box. And I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Okay, I have a belt. And this belt probably came from the same woman who uh, had the painty hose or the knee highs. Yeah. It is a belt. An interesting belt. It is a, it's from Discovery. With a heart. Um, it tri tone loop belt comparison to $10.99, but the Discovery price was $5.99. I don't know anything about Discovery Store. I've never heard of it. Of course, you know, $5.99 it is man made material in case you were curious. So there you go. That was that watch with the knee highs make a pretty combination okay we have this now one last thing so I will open that I am glad I did get paper though <laughs> I got tissue paper for reselling okay I have a it has a looks like Vera Bradley but this thing doesn't say Vera Bradley but yeah Vera Bradley. Just a little, like, makeup change thing. I don't know what you put in it. Probably a little makeup put in your purse, but yeah. I'm assuming it was a set. Went with something, I guess. I don't know. This is probably a retired pattern, Vera Bradley, so. And one more thing. This, I think it's leather. It is leather. And it's got that marking on it don't know what it is the marking it is like a an A or is it a V it's a V G V it is a my guess a Gloria Vanderbilt wallet it is real leather a little change thing and I assume probably the woman that had the belt and the knee highs packed this. Yeah, Gloria Vanderbilt. From the Vanderbilts. The heiress from the Vanderbilts. Yeah. Gloria, I have your wallet. But anywho, yeah, so. That was the fun box. You know what? You all give me your opinions. What do you think? Um, because I don't know what to think right now. 
I have gotten awesome fun boxes before, but this was a little um, interesting. So I'll let you all tell me what you all think of it and decide. Uh, okay, now I have the uh, active box. Now the active box was, let me see here. I have it on my laptop. It was $24. And you can choose the size. I chose, I know I chose the large, extra large. Um, yeah, that's what I chose. I didn't pay for shipping. So it was just $24 and it's supposed to be five items. So let's check that out. I might ought to use the headband because I my hair is doing a Joe Dirt thing. <sighs> if it's anything like the fun box. Good thoughts, good thoughts, good thoughts. Okay. Of course, got the invoice. And the care for thing. I didn't get a coupon with that one, though. The whole... I don't know. Okay. All right. Looks to be... Can you all see that? An Under Armour sweatshirt. In white. Hoodie. Yeah, Under Armour hoodie. The Under Armour. Looks really good. Uh, it's got like some spots there. Can you see it? Yeah, right there. And right here on the elbow. Or is that Lint right there? Might be Lint. Yeah, that was Lint. Um, just needs. I'm always, when it comes to sweatshirts and stuff, I always look like around here. The cuff parts. Because, you know, if you're a busy person and you're especially a mom, for some reason it does get a little, it can get dingy. Running errands and doing things all day. And Okay, this is a large. It is a large. So, I'll see if I can get that. I'll spot treat it and see if I can get that out before I sell it. If not, I will disclose, you know, it. Now, okay, $24. Yeah, okay. I just spend $24. What is this? This is a large breathe gap fit thing here. It's not bad. I mean, it's gray. Feels nice. But it is a large. I was really hoping for some extra large. That's why I picked that. But okay. Two larges. I don't know what that what the resale is on this. I'm assuming not very much. I might have to like do like a large activewear bundle thing. Okay, now this here has what is this? Okay, has like a breathable like sleeve and it's got the little thumb thing on it. Yeah, where your little thumb pokes out. This is an Avia, Avia Large 1214. Yeah, this has some uh, wear to it. It's got like the, you know, that thing hanging off that can be cut off. I don't think it's going to bother the way it's made. Somebody really did like this top though. It has been loved. Which is, it's a cool top. It really is. I don't know how these sleeves would look on but yeah I'm not sure what this is worth I'd have to like look it up and see what do we got here we have some Puma some Puma shorts do they have any spots on them yeah they got a spot Right there. I don't know if you guys can see it so well. So, I mean, it is tiny. It can be spot treated, I'm sure. Probably come out. But, yeah. Some Puma shorts. In a size. What size are these? Large. Huh. I really was hoping for extra large. Okay. And here's the last, how many pieces did I say? Five. So that's, let me count so far. One, two, three, four. 
no extra no extra in this box they usually do extra okay and these leggings which are really cool loving the design on them yeah those are cool what brand are they these are Massimo extra large okay I did get one extra large thing might keep them I don't know I'm still dieting and it's driving me crazy I have good days and I have bad days I have days that oh I feel amazing and I still have days like I want to kill someone yeah those kind of days so but anywho I do like these now $24 y'all let me know if y'all thought that was worth it um I'm a little lackluster is it lackluster or lack of luck I don't I'm just a little blue on it not for sure um what to think so y'all let me know if y'all thought that was worth the $24 and you all let me know about the <laughs> fun box which I think it was more fun for the employee than it was for me so we can compare that let's do a comparison now I can put all this right here one of the boxes were in pretty bad shape that I got not on the person the poshers um the the reseller that I got it from the yeah reseller I got it purchased it from not on their end it was just I guess with the weather and stuff um the box was in rough shape so I all the clothes I had to check and see so I will the box I had to open I will leave for last and I'm going to do this box right here now this came from I hope the posture is okay let me look this up again um from Sophia underscore Rose 1216 and I did pay a little more for this box. It's supposed to be a reseller mystery box 10 for $50 designer clothes. I did not pay $50 for it. I ended up paying $45 for it and $4.99 shipping. Um, the, it says, let me see. The description is reseller mystery box at least one new with tag um, 10 items ranging for all ranging for all styles and sizing and sizes of clothing brands may include theory Vince free people anthropology anthropology brands Lily Pulitzer Lululemon which I wish I would have got that we don't get that around here uh, Madwell is it Cavi, J Brand, to name a few, but not limited to, all in great condition. So let's see. It came, you know, in this box here. So let's see what we got. Okay, the first thing it looks to be a pair of jeans. Let's see. Oh, page. I'm not complaining. Page jeans, size 28, zipper accent, yo, even on the bottom. And they look to be in really great condition. These are crop. These are not, yeah, there was a little lint on it. But these are not full length. These are crop. But skinny page jeans. Okay, I'm not, not regretting it so far because, I mean, we don't get really page around here. But I do know Paige is a good brand and it sells well and, or what I've seen, maybe it sells well and it sells pretty high. So, not bad. Not bad at all. I'm trying to like fluff it so it doesn't look like Joe Dirt, but I think I'm just making it worse. Oh, okay. Now, we have, looks to be, can you see? Ralph. RLX Ralph Lauren XL and it is brand new brand new the tag on it had $89 and then can you see it I'm sorry is it it's golf okay it's for golf 
Yeah, eighty nine fifty, but the store tag says sixty three dollars. So still not bad. I mean, weather's coming up. It's new. Oh, it's got, ooh, it's got cute little cap sleeves on it. That's really cute. So, not too bad at all. I want your all's opinion so far. What are you all thinking? Please let me know. Leave a comment. Especially those that have reselling experience. Love to hear from you guys. Let me know what are you all thinking of these boxes so far. Okay, here's something else with the tag. It's blue and gray. XL. It feels amazing. It feels like cashmere. It feels awesome, and I'm loving the gray color. Love it. It is an extra large. I'm not going to keep it. I was an extra large till I put on a bunch of weight this summer, so I'm hoping to get back to what I was. I'm hoping. But anywho, yeah. The tag... The original price was forty nine fifty. Don't know much about Lou and Gray. I'll have to look that up. But just by feeling of it, I'm telling you, it just feels like it's a really good high end brand. Okay, what else do we got? We have a T-shirt here, a red T-shirt. Madwell. Madwell. Extra small, little pocket tee with a V-neck. Not bad. Not bad at all. Wish my hair would do like something and get on my face. There we go. There. Okay, what else we got? We have a pair of Reebok shorts. They're new. They were $20. They're large, solid mesh short in the caviar color it says they're girls they're girls so they are a size large 12 to 14 girl sizes not bad hmm. i think pulling my hair out just made it worse well no the older i get the more my hair wants to do like it did back in school back in the 80s when we did those big puffs it's like my that hairspray must have been really good because I or it just got sunk down into my DNA because my hair still wants to do those same styles. Okay. Here we go. It was Aquanet. Aquanet got into your DNA. Um, Puma. Got a Puma. Size small. New. $28. T-shirt. I love the feel of it very nice it looks to be like a small it's a small and it almost it's like a high low it's like higher in the front lower in the back kind of thing little oversized yeah it's cute 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 and it's new that's nice nobody sweated in it okay here we go looks to be like another new top how many is that so far i'll have to count and this is also, this is a large Ralph Lauren. Is this golfing also? Yes. RLX Ralph Lauren Golf. This also was 80, oh, this was $85, and then it sold for $59.50. I love, I'm digging the colors. That's pretty. It feels nice, too. It's got the right thing it's slimming the illusion of slimming yeah so that's nice um how they have it folded i'm just going to set it on the bag for right now and then re refold it in a minute because i want to get through this video it's already 30 minutes that's mean that's long i'm sorry about that guys this is a flax P, so P for small, petite, I don't know. It is, I can tell already, like it comes up high in the back, a little longer. This is linen. This feels amazing. Yeah, this is linen. 
And it looks to be like another one in the green. They got that green and this one looks to be like a lavender done in the same thing. Again, not familiar with this, but it being linen and it feels amazing. I'm sorry, my hair is getting on my nerves so bad. It'd be nice to be a poof hair did. Okay, and this seems to be the last one. This is really cute. It is a uh, uh, Masoni. Am I pronouncing that right? For Target. Oh, okay. It's for Target. It's an XL. The colors are amazing in it. It's hooded. Now remember, I paid forty-five dollars for it, plus four ninety-nine shipping. It's also got pockets. It is nice, and it zips up. Oh, and it, I mean, that's really cute. So, that's what I paid for that box. You all let me know if you all think that was worth it. Let me see if that was 10 items. That is one, two in this. So, that's three, <coughs> four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. That's ten items in that. Okay. You know what? I like it, and I'm impressed with it. Let me know what you all think if it was worth it in the long run. I think with the page of jeans, it paid for itself right then and there. Okay, now here comes the second box I got from them. And I had to, remember, I had to get all this stuff 